Yemi Mobilade has been the toast of the town since he became the mayor elect in Colorado Springs last month. But today he says it's time to step out of the limelight and into his new role as the city's top leader. Cardio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison is live at the Pioneers Museum downtown where Mobilade was sworn in earlier today. Scott. Well, Heather, the mayor remarked after the ceremony here today that eight years from now, he wants to be able to help his predecessor, his successor, I should say, follow in his footsteps as departing mayor John Southers did for him. Maybe a hint that Mobilati is already thinking about re-election? Well, as we ponder that, we'll take you to the scene here on the south lawn of the Pioneers Museum earlier this morning, and it was packed. Estimates are that around 1,200 people attended Mobilade's ascension to mayor this morning. Mobilade thanked the mayors who came before him, expressed gratitude to voters for electing him, and asked the people who voted against him to give him a chance to show that he is an effective leader. And he says that process started this afternoon. This afternoon, I have a two-hour meeting with my cabinet and the directors. We're going to establish the right culture. We're going to talk about the right vision. And then I'm going to listen and hear from them. And so they're my first priority today. And so um, the, work is, the work ahead of me is what I'm thinking about these days. I worry about re-election in, in, in the future. Now, Mobilati's parents were here to see him sworn in today. He says that he's humble and thankful that he can lead a city which best days are still ahead. The new mayor has now started his 100-day blueprint, and he plans to update us on that in September, just in time for his first State of the City address. We're live in downtown Colorado Springs. Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.